contributes a good news for Libya. Al Sharara oil field, which is the largest oil field in Libya, and which was closed. Now production of oil uh, from this oil field it has started. This oil field has a daily production capacity of around 300,000 barrels per day, and it is around one third to one fourth of total uh, Libyan oil production capacity per day. So definitely this. Uh, resumption of oil from Al Sharara oil field it will help Libyan economy a lot but in this video viewers I'll inform you about the company which is working here and the circumstances in which this resumption of production of oil it was managed from this oil field firstly viewers this oil field Al Sharara it is situated in Marzak district and this Marzak is part of Fezzan territory three major divisions of Libya viewers Tiplitania, uh, Serenega and Fezzan. Tiplitania is western Libya broadly speaking and uh, Serenega is eastern Libya and this territory Fezzan it is southern Libya. This Marzak district it is part of Fezzan territory. Now viewers if you remember almost a month ago I recorded a video and I informed you about this Marzak district that the people of uh, this district, the tribes, they had announced to back GNA. But back then GNA was busy as Al Wati Air Base, its siege was going on, uh, siege of Trahona was going on. So GNA could not follow up on this announcement by tribes of Merzak. On the other hand, viewers, LNA, they were quick to respond, they started patrolling here. So the area remained aligned with LNA to a large extent. And last month viewers, we saw that a group aligned with LNA, it closed down the wall uh, along the Al Hamada pipeline which runs from this uh, oil field Al Sharara to uh, uh, Zawiya oil refinery because the oil which is produced from this uh, oil field, it is mostly pumped through this pipeline to Zawiya oil refinery. Where it is refined and then it is exported. Uh, now viewers, uh, the company which is working on this oil field, it is Eni. Eni is an Italian company as I informed you in one of my previous videos that several European companies, they are involved in production sector in Libya. They have huge investments here and the largest investor is this company Eni, uh, which is an Italian company. After that, there is Total, which is a French company. Then companies from Spain and Austria, they are also they have also invested in this uh, production sector, oil production sector in Libya. Uh, now, viewers, uh, it has come to notice that in Zintan, negotiations took place between NOC, National Oil Corporation of Libya, and a group which was aligned with LNA in the past and the fighters of this group they had closed down the walls uh, of, of uh, on the al hamada pipeline uh, last month these negotiations they were fruitful and ultimately these walls were opened and now this resumption of oil production from this oil field it has started so far it isn't clear viewer it isn't clear uh, whether gna is in full control of this uh, oil field or there is some sort of agreement between GNA and the groups aligned with LNA but the good news that at least production of oil is starting 